Hey everyone, welcome back to another tutorial. I have another Discord server tutorial for you guys. Uh, this one is a lot more useful than my previous one. Um, but if you are running a public server like what I have here, you know, you know all these servers on the side where you know you're probably following or a, a member of a bunch of you know your favorite um, YouTubers or streamer servers and pretty much 99% of the time they have like an announcements channel which if you look at my server you know it just shows up when I upload a video uh, or when someone is live and if you're gonna you know make your own discord server for your viewers or your fans you probably want the same thing but you've noticed that you know it's kind of hard to do some bots like me six they work like half the time for some reason on my friends discord server the discord um the discord me six bot works um, but it doesn't, it never worked on mine. I have me six here, but whenever I upload a video, me six would just never announce it. So with my own experimenting, my own research, I figured the best way to actually get, um, an announcement, uh, to your discord members of, of a new video of yours is using a web hooks uh, on the website called Zapier. So as you can see, this is what it will look like. Uh, you can change the avatar and then the, the name of the bot. It's not really a bot, it's a web hook. Uh, and you can, you can add everyone. You can actually customize a message. Uh, well, customize it to an extent and you know it works uh in my experience like 100 well, of the time uh so the first thing you want to do is of course obviously before we actually go online make the discord server i have a tutorial server here and you know usually uh you want to have something like an announcements channel right they usually have an announcements channel and the everyone role which is you know new people joining the server they shouldn't be allowed to send messages um at all right so just uh, go and uh, what I did there was I click the edit channel permissions and uh, when you're clicking on the everyone role Make sure they cannot send messages or text-to-speech mess messages. So, yeah, make sure they can't send messages in your announcements So now we have our own announcements uh, text channel, which is great uh, So now once you have that done what you want to do is go to, on this website called zapier.com It's just Z or Z a P I E R dot com Right, I'm just gonna go to the original website and it will actually take you here, yeah, you actually do need to make an account, but don't worry, it's totally free. Um, you can even use a fake email if you want, um, because you don't need, to, well, unless you have to confirm it. I think you have to confirm it, confirm it, so you can just use those websites that give you like a temporary email if you don't really want to. But don't worry, this website totally, <laughs> is totally trustworthy. So when you first make your account, the first screen you'll see is probably not doesn't look like this. I think when you first sign on, it will look like this, it'll be, or it'll be a screen similar to this. So what you want to do is search for YouTube and just click that. Make sure you only um, actually click one thing. Like when you first start off, it'll ask you to click a bunch of apps that is, um, you know, that you like. Um, you can do that step, but for this, you know, to actually get to the YouTube and, you know, make a zap on YouTube uh, by clicking this button, you have to clear all those other apps that you clicked up. So make sure you just click YouTube, right? And click make a zap with YouTube. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, what zaps are, don't worry. I didn't know what zap and what zapier and what webhooks were until like weeks ago, you know, just very recently when I tried to do this myself. So don't worry about it. Just follow exactly what I do. It's fairly easy. And once you set it up, uh, d it, you don't have to do any more tinkering. It will just automatically, every time you upload a video, boom, you'll have an announcement on your announcements channel like what I have here. So now you'll get be taken to this page. Uh, step one is called the trigger, the YouTube trigger. So uh, this is just choosing uh, what you want um, the trigger, like what you want uh, to the announcement to be. Obviously, you want to have a new video and channel. Uh, the new video, it, you can just do uh, a specific username. This is a specific channel. I don't know really what the difference is, uh, but this one is actually pretty cool. You can do a new video by a search string, so you don't have to upload just videos from one channel. Let's say you have in a like a Fortnite videos announcement channel, right, or some or like a, a Sony Vegas one or like tutorial or something like that. So you can have a, a text channel that only you know announces videos that are related to a certain search string that you entered, which is a pretty cool feature. But for this one, you really want to show your viewers in your Discord server your own videos, right? So you want to do new video and channel, save and continue. Then you need to connect your account. Uh, you just press connect an account here. I'm going to choose my own and you just click allow. So now uh, I named it something else. I'm just going to call it a uh, tutorial. All right. Uh, now you can click test and if it works, it's where it works. There we go. So you press save and continue. Uh, now you need to actually 
put in your channel ID, right? Which is like that string of letters and numbers that you get when you go sign into your account. So I'm just gonna quickly get that. All right, so now that I have my ID, uh, to find yours, you actually wanna go to youtube.com slash account underscore advanced. Uh, you wanna go to this website right here. I'm not gonna click on it because I'm pretty sure there's some information that shouldn't be shown on public. But yeah, you have to go on this website, youtube.com slash account underscore advanced. Make sure you're signed in so it'll automatically go to your advanced. Then you just look for the one that says YouTube channel ID, not user ID. Make sure it says channel ID, all right? Enter your ID, press continue. This is just a test right now. You, you can skip this, but I really recommend just testing it just to see, just so uh, just click fetch and continue. It's gonna test looking for existing video. And if you have a video, you can the test will be successful. So now you can just press continue again. And now the next thing you wanna do is actually, uh, the second app is of course gonna be our Discord, but there actually is no Discord app in here, right? Like, so actually, well, this is recent. Like, I swear to you guys, last week, Discord was not a thing. I just, it is in beta, so it is really recent. But, um, you know what? I might have another updated tutorial if this Discord thing is better. <laughs> God damn it. So, okay, you, you can try Discord for now, but I, I just found this just now. You guys see my live reaction to this. So, um, yeah, you can try out Discord. I might do an updated tutorial, actually. But... You know, the thing I'm gonna show you that I know works, that it's not in beta, is webhooks, right? It's webhooks by Zapier. Oh my god, that was an epic, epic fail. All right, so hey everyone, this is Justin from the future. I'm just adding this little voiceover in post editing. Um, I tried out the the Discord app on Zapier that's in beta, and you know, I, it doesn't really work that well. Like I haven't really, I mean, it worked on Discord, but like the thumbnail didn't show up in the link. So obviously, it's still in beta, so it might not work all the time. So for now, um, until something changes or until it goes out of beta or when I try it in the future and it works better, uh, I, I still recommend to use the thing I'm gonna show you next right which is webhooks and not this discord app i mean it's cool and in the future when it's out of beta and they tinker around with it and they actually show the thumbnail of the video then this is definitely a better way and i will have an updated tutorial but for now just follow the rest of this tutorial so that is the second app so you want to link of course you're linking youtube with the webhooks and the webhooks is technically the discord channel so that's what it's doing so uh when you're in webhooks what you want to do is uh, you have to fire off a post, right? Which is just uh, a whole post on your Discord server that, again, is this. That's what it is, basically. So, you want to click post, save, and continue. And this is what the template will look like. This is how you want your thing to look like. So, for the URL, uh, this is really easy to get. Uh, you actually, it's not a URL in Zapier or anything. You actually, it's a Discord URL. So, what I want to do is go to your server, go to server settings, and go to webhooks. Then you click create webhook. You can name your webhook whatever you want. I'm just gonna call it new YT video. Uh, and you make sure you choose the correct channel in announcements. You can make your own like avatar, I'm not going to. And this is the webhook URL that you need to copy. So just click the copy button right there. Press save, make sure you save it. Uh, make sure that webhook shows up there. Then you control and paste that Discord URL. It's really long, but don't worry about it. Into there. So for the payload type, make sure you choose JSON. That's very important too. And for the data, this is uh, this is really important. This is what uh, obviously what you want. So you just in this first box, you press content, and in here, this is where you can add your uh, field. So you can add the title of your video and the URL. This is the pretty the most important things. But to actually make your announcements, you know, um, have a notification to your you know your members of Discord, you. You could actually add any type of text you want here. So um, what you have to do to get announcements, if you notice on every single Discord server, you ha um, the announcement at, at everyone, right? Because if you add everyone, it will send a notification uh, to everybody in the server. Uh, it, it's, but unless, of course, they don't have mentioned notifications uh, set. If they, have no, if they mute your server, they won't get this, but... Yeah, and don't worry if you have your server so that the everyone role can't add everyone. Obviously, this webhook bot is has admin privileges, so it can add everyone and it will give them a notification. So what I recommend doing is just doing add everyone and then you add your title, click that button, and then you add your YouTube URL. You, you, the most important thing is a YouTube URL, obviously, since you want them to click, uh, have something to click on. So now we are pretty much done. Yeah, make sure you have that at everyone so that it, it, it notifies everyone in your server. Make sure you click content, just copy everything I have here, right? Then you just press continue. 
right? You can just review this if it's all good. Then you press send test to web hosted by Zapier. And as you can hear, I got a notification. If I go to my tutorial server, there we go. My new YouTube video, uh, it adds everyone. It has, it gives the title and it gives the link. You just click on the link and it'll take you to the new video. So now the test is successful. Then if you just click finish, the last thing you have to do is just name it. I'm just gonna call it uh, test zap for, for YT and just click the on button. So now there we go. Every time you upload a new video, the Zapier webhook, it's, it says bot, but it's not a bot at all. As you see, there's no bots inside there. It will do this exact form of post, uh, obviously changing the title and the link, uh, to this uh, announcements channel. So it's just really great. It's a really cool feature. So from what I've heard and from what I've experienced, it won't uh, it won't uh, instantly announce it when you upload your video, like right on the minute. Uh, you might want to give it five minutes, and sometimes I've actually had to wait like 30 minutes. Um, but don't worry, it will work. But a way to get around that, and actually in my uh, announcement channel uh, I uploaded my video at 12 and of course this had did, did it three minutes later and I uploaded this at 2 and it did one minute later so if you want it to be the fastest you have to upload your you have to schedule upload your videos which only you know monetized channels can do but yeah that's just a way to get around it so this video was a little long I kind of went in depth and over explained everything but yeah thank you guys so much for watching I hope this helped if you have any questions or concerns uh, join my server I'm, I'm on it right now it's Oreo Kingdom and if you go to the support channel you can ask you can at me and you can ask me questions and that definitely will help you or my mods will help you too which you know, I have a great community on there. The mods are great. They can help you out. Uh, obviously, if you don't have access to Discord, just leave in the comments below. That's, you know, it's a lot harder, harder for me to, to reply to them. If you join my Discord server, I can definitely 100% uh, reply to you. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Uh, hope this helped you guys out. And, you know, enjoy uh, your announcements with your YouTube videos to your Discord members. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.